I look forward to more experiences like this with my daughters. Pottery making, I think it's, it's, it's just bringing back the old ways, so I see that. Okay, once you get your water poured off, you might want to come sit over here in front. I'm going to do a demonstration of what, how it, you should make a pot. It's a learning curve for everybody, you know, them and me. They prevailed and they, some, they made at least something, you know. The best part of the class was being able to learn something traditional that our people have done with my daughters. Yeah. Having them here with me and me being Coca Pot, their Coca Pot, it just felt right. See where the color is darker than. So that's the line. No one ever starts and is perfect in the beginning. Everybody has to learn how to, how they say you have to crawl before you can walk, you know. And I think a lot of times, especially with younger generations, they have that attitude that they want everything to be perfect right from the get go. And there's no such thing, you know. Everybody has to start out somewhere. It, was, it wasn't easy. He did make it look easy. It was a lot of hard work. He is a really good instructor and he's been teaching for years, so he knows what he's doing. And I believe that every one of us were just sitting around him, listening to him, giving us directions, how to start, where to start, what tools to use. That was awesome. I believe that with the younger generation working around me, I, you know, it is a pleasure that they're learning all of these and I'm learning this at an older age, but it's awesome if they can pick that up and, um, you know, bring back the old Kokopa ways how to, um, uh, to work with pottery. I'm following steps of past generations and ancestors, and it was like pretty humble creating and forming an imperfect but perfect bowl. Hopefully that they can keep doing it and then eventually someday, you know, the yeah. Cocopa people will be, you know, continue to make pottery and be, revive that tradition among them. And uh, hopefully someday I'll be, when I'm an old, old man, I'm sitting there, they can be bring pots to me and show me what they made. And I'll say, good for you. That's it. Yeah. That's